on the last episode of Dragon Ball Z. Dang it, I keep doing that. Wait, okay, get it right this time. Ugh. Twilight Princess The Abridged Series. Okay, there we go. Link had just completed the Forest Temple, and Midna was about to say something very important to the plot, but was cut off at the last minute by Zond. It was all part of my diabolically evil plan. Yeah. Shut up. Sorry. So anyways, Midna told Link that, um, um, I seem to have lost the script for this particular scene. Well, guess I'm just gonna kinda wing it or something. So, uh, anyways, there's these, um, the things, the rock thingies that go in Midna's head and somehow they gives her the power to break through the force field around Ganon's tower, or something. Uh, it basically makes her rock hat thingy look even more ridiculous. And apparently, each of these three different rock pieces are spread out throughout the next three temples for some reason. So anyways, after that, Link, uh, left the, the, the wood thingy, I forgot the name because I still can't find my script. Well, anyways, Link left the woods thingy, went across the high real the whatever field, and traveled to Kakariko Village in order to free that town from the Twilight Realm. Meanwhile, while Link was doing this, the children were apparently hiding in some kind of uh, Indian casino or something to hide from the Twilight monsters. No oh, man, I see those monsters out there, man. They're gonna get us, man. Game over, man. Game over. Yes, Satan's army has finally arrived. The day of Brachadega's cub. You shall all be destroyed, but I shall be seated at Satan's right hand side. Long live hell. Long live Satan. What did I say about the Satan crap? It won't matter what you think, for very soon you will be my slave. Well, go to hell! That's precisely what I'm counting on. Oh man, I see that monster out there, man. I think he sees us. He just flipped me off. Jerk, you have to stop what you are doing. You are scaring the children. Hey man, I'm just telling it like it is, man. What the heck is wrong with your voice, man? It doesn't even match your character, man. I know it does not match the character very well. A Jamaican accent would probably have been a lot better, but the voice actor is not really good at making Jamaican accents, so he sort of just did this instead. Ah, oh, they're after me like he charms. Man, is it just me or is the voice actor starting to run out of original voices? Oh, it's starting to get a bit lonely in here without Link. Oh well, at least I still have my Link action figure. I'm sad. What is the problem? I might never ever be able to have sex with Link. It's alright. I understand how you feel. I want to have sex with Link too. We're going to have to be strong enough to pull through this. Together. You know, man, I don't know who this Link guy is, man, but he sounds pretty hot. Hold on a second. Is it me or does everybody in this room want to have sex with Link? Well, I want to have sex. I want to have sex with him. I've tried raping him once. Well, this is certainly awkward. So then, Link killed some bugs, collected some light spheres, blew up a house, and saved the village from the twilight, blah blah blah. Let's just get the episode started. Hey, look, it's another spirit. Hey, can you help me? No, I'm lazy too. Dang it. Hey, it's you guys. And I'm the man who kept them safe. What's wrong with your voice? It really doesn't- I know, it doesn't really match the character. We've already made that joke. Alright, look, I need to get up on Goron Mountain to get into the next temple or something. Feel free to go up the mountain, right up there. The Gorons are very friendly. They love humans. Oh, great. Ah! Ow. Jackass. Ah, what the hell? You told me it was safe. Oh, I just wanted to see if you'd do it, and you totally did. Oh, that was so funny. But no, seriously, they hate humans. Well, how am I supposed to get up there then? Well, there is only one man I know who was able to gain the trust of the Gorons. Really? Who is it? Link, you've come back to me. And you're riding a horse. Mmm. Ah, <sighs> look, Mayor. Wait a minute. I am riding a horse. Apona, when did you get back here? Um, I don't know. I think you found me in Kakariko Village or something. Oh. Ah, oh. I, we must have skipped that part or something. Hmm. Oh well, anyways, uh... Look, Mirbo, you can hit on me later. Right now, I need your help. If it involves you and me being naked... 
then yes, I can help you. Mirbeau, I'm not asking for sex, I'm asking for help. Naked help? <sighs> Look, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I need to come inside your house. Mirbeau? <coughs> oh god. This is the happiest day of my life. <gasps> Look, can I just come in or not? Oh yes, yes, please come in. You know, if you'd like, I can bake you some cookies. Nothing says loving like something from the oven. Oh god. A few minutes later in Maribo's house. So then I found out that I was some kind of legendary hero. So now I'm on this mission to go through a bunch of random temples, I don't really know why. Apparently so far I've been collecting these random rock things, I still don't know why. But long story short, I need your help getting into the Goron Mines. Hmm, well that's a pretty interesting story. Why don't you make yourself comfortable somewhere and tell me all the details? Like, on my bed for example. Um, uh, n no thanks. I think I'll just stand back, unviolated, over here. Hmm, I bet it gets pretty hot inside that dirty old tunic. You know, if you start getting a little hot and sweaty, it's alright with me if you want to take all your clothes off. I'm perfectly fine with it. Um, sir, I'm not going to take off my clothes. Oh, that's fine. If you're self-conscious about it, I can take off my clothes, too. Please, Mirbo, I need your advice about dealing with the Gorons. Hmm, well here's an idea. Why don't we continue this conversation in my shower? Naked. Mirbo, I don't have time for this. Are you sure? Don't you want to sit down and have some of those cookies I made? Um, no, Mare, I'm fine, really. Are you sure? They're fresh out of the oven. Uh, no. Really, I'm not interested. They're chocolate chip. No, Mare, I know you drug the cookies. Look, Mirbo, I'm on a mission right now, okay? You can make horrible attempts at trying to seduce me later, but right now I just need you to cooperate with me. Without taking your pants off. Yeah, you're right, Link. Now is not the time to discuss love. I'll do you, help you. Sorry. So what do you need to know? Well, I need to get into the Goron Caverns, but the Gorons won't let me in. I need to know how to gain the approval of the Gorons and earn their trust. And some random guy in town with a weird accent told me that you might know. Well, that man with the weird accent whose son I've probably slept with was right. I do know how to gain the Goron's approval. There's only one way to do it, too. And what's that? You have to beat them in a wrestling match. Well, that's great. I don't know how to wrestle. And who the heck is supposed to teach me how to... Oh, God, no. Now, before you say anything... Oh, for the love of God. You might not realize this, but I used to be a professional wrestler. I can take you down to my love chamber, I mean, wrestling stadium, and teach you how to wrestle. Well, I guess I don't have any choice. Come on, Link, follow me and I'll show you my penis. What? I'll show you my wrestling stadium. A few minutes later... Well, here we are, in my wrestling chamber. All alone, with nobody else. I can't believe you have an entire wrestling chamber down here. Yep, I started my wrestling career about 25 years ago. Is that when you built this thing? Actually, no, I started building it the day after I met you. Um, yeah, I, uh, I, I changed my mind. I think I'm just gonna leave now. Too late, Link. I've already locked the door. And the key's inside my pocket. Unless you want to reach in there and grab it yourself. Mmm. <laughs> Alright, Link. We'll take a few minutes to get prepared, and then we'll start wrestling. A few moments of wrestling preparation later. So, Link, are you ready for 350 pounds of pure sweaty Caucasian man? Ew. Something tells me that this is going to severely scar me for life. Alright, so remember the rules. You can use your hands to grab your opponent, Grab my opponent and what? Oh, sorry, I was I was thinking about the grabbing p Anyways. Look, uh, Maribo, I understand why we need to wrestle, but is there a not completely disgusting reason why we're both half naked? Um, well, uh, yes, because in uh, a wrestling, the the clothing can uh, affect the uh the the speed of the uh the the, the yeah, so anyways, let's wrestle. Um, but you didn't completely answer- Let's just wrestle. But you- Link, I've been waiting to get you in this room for the past 16 years. Don't ruin it for me. Oh, whatever. Let's just get this over with. One childhood destroying wrestling match later. Hmm, well, I think that was a pretty good lesson, don't you? I feel dirty. Really? I thought that was a pretty nice clean match. Oh, yeah, except for those five consecutive personal fouls. But there was just an accident. Oh yeah, like I'm supposed to believe that you accidentally grabbed my- don't Forget it, I don't even want to think about it. I'm getting out of here. Oh, Link, before you go, there's something I want to give you. Oh no! Ah! No, Link, it's not like that. Trust me, I already got my fill for today. 
but I need to give you these. What the heck are these? Boots. Really, really heavy boots. And how are these boots actually going to help me? Well, the Gorons are very, very big. With these boots, you won't get moved as easily, so now you'll be able to stand a better chance against the Gorons. So, other than being incredibly heavy and painful to wear, what else can these things do? They can make it completely impossible for you to walk, and they can help make it easier for you to drown underwater. Ah, uh, yep, figures. Now, Link, before you go off to save the world, I just want to say something to you from the bottom of my heart. I know how hard it must be for you to have to leave me like this, but it... Link? He'll come back. I know he'll come back. Hmm. <laughs> I'm so lonely. Oh well, at least I still have my Link action figure.